Hey guys, this is Steve from Trim That Weed, and welcome to our video of the 2021 vs 2022 Trek Dual Sport lineup. Watch till the end to know our final verdict on which one is better. So, the main difference between the 2021 and 2022 bike models is their entire drivetrain. The 2021 Dual Sport 1 used the Shimano Tourney and Atlas components, which are the lowest level drivetrain parts from Shimano. This system had 3x7 gears, with 21 different speeds. The new drivetrain on the 2022 bike has a simplified version, the 2.8 drivetrain with 16 different speeds for commuting and general riding. The 2x system has fewer issues with the drivetrain and less maintenance. The front derailleurs have been upgraded from the Turney TY510 to the TY710, which works better with the 2x drivetrain. The crankset has been changed from the 28, 38, 48 tooth crankset to the 46, 30 crankset. On the rear gears, the 2021 bike had the 1434 tooth freewheel, while the new bike upgrades to the Shimano 1132 tooth cassette. The same crankset upgrades are found on the Dual Sport 2 models, but with a slight change to the 1136 tooth cassette in the 2022 bike. The 2022 bike has harder gears for pedaling faster, making it a faster bike, but it loses on the upper gears for easier uphill pedaling. The 2021 Dual Sport 2 has a drivetrain with mixed parts from Shimano Tourney, Atlas, and Acera, while the new 2022 bikes use the Atlas and Acera parts. The 3x8 drivetrain with 24 speeds has been upgraded to the 2x9 with 18 speeds. The shifters change from the Atlas M315 to the M2010 shifters that are a bit smoother. The front derailleur has been swapped from the Tourney TY710 to the Acera T3000 which is much smoother and quicker, and the rear derailleur from the Shimano Acera to Atlas 2000 that is more durable. The 2022 Dual Sport 3 was upgraded from the Shimano Acera and Alivio 2x9 drivetrain to a mainly Dior 1x10 drivetrain, with only one gear in the front. The 2021 Acera shifters have been replaced with one Dior shifter for the new bike that works better with the drivetrain and has an ergonomic trigger. The 2021 bike used the Acera front derailleur, but it's omitted in the new bike. The mid-range Olivio rear derailleur was replaced with the Dior rear derailleur with a clutch mechanism that prevents the chain from falling off the bike, skipping gears, and making noise. The Shimano 4630 crankset has been replaced with the Pro Wheel 40 crankset. The cassette also got an upgrade from the Shimano 1136 to the Shimano Dior 1146 to give you a wider range since it has only one gear at the front. Color changes. The 2022 colors are more vibrant and attractive colors than the 2021 model. The 2021 Dual Sport 1 had two colors, including the Trek Black and Viper Red, but the new 2022 bike replaces these colors with Lithium Gray, Quicksilver, and Satin Deep Dark Blue. The 2021 Dual Sport 2 has Metallic Gunmetal and Mulsanne Blue that has changed to Trek Black, Viper Red, and Mulsanne Blue in the 2022 bike. The 2021 Dual Sport 3 came in factory orange and lithium gray, but the 2022 bike was upgraded to three colors, including dark aquatic, rage red, and matte trek black. Rear hub. The 2022 Dual Sport 1 has a better hub upgrade cassette. The 2021 Dual Sport 1 bike rear hub got an upgrade from the Formula DC31 to the Formula DC22 hub in the 2022 bike. This hub uses the Shimano 8910 free hub instead of the 678 speed freewheel in the 2021 bike. Comparison. Which is better? All the 2022 bikes have very good upgrades, and with only a slight increase in their prices, it's worth getting the 2022 bikes. If you like this video, please hit the thumbs up button and subscribe to our channel. Also, let us know which other comparisons you'd like to see next from us.